Hello and welcome to Reality News Roundup, your daily dose of real estate news. Let's take a look at the top headlines of the day. Real estate has emerged as the preferred asset building avenue for most of the ministers in the union cabinet, while a few have been known to invest in other financial instruments like bonds and other stocks. The Supreme Court has directed to auction the assets of Pearl's Group's company. The money raised from the auction will be used to refund the investors. Nearly 60 million investors had deposited over 49,000 crore in Ponzi schemes of the firm. Real estate giant DLF Limited has reported consolidated net profit of Rs 164 crore for the December quarter, up 24% from the same quarter last year. The Rajasthan state government will construct 96 flats at Vidhayak Nagar West in first phase to accommodate the members of Legislative Assembly. PWD has projected Rs 120 crore for the construction, while about 30 crore will be utilised to furnish these flats. The Silicon City of India, Bengaluru, has topped the City Momentum Index rankings for Asia-Pacific. This ranking was released by a leading global real estate advisory. The city's rapid progress in technology and global connectivity helped drive real estate growth here. Thank you for watching today's Reality News Roundup. For latest updates, follow our social media handles on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube and Instagram.